Hello, I'm Red Moon. And I'm Blue Moon. And today we're going to be telling our Animal Crossing villagers as people. not be obsessed with Animal Crossing. Um, we don't have the Nintendo Switch version of the game, but we do have Pocket Camp, and I really love all my villagers, and I just want to draw them because they're so freaking cute. I love Freya. She's my bias. I already have the perfect fit in my head that I'm going to draw her in. Right now, I can imagine it perfectly. So, Blue Moon does not have a favorite character right now. She has a lot of people in her campsite, so we have all of her villagers in a cup. That at least like the ones ours. at my official camp and not my cabin. But we have their names written down. She's going to be picking out of a hat. I'm not because no one is making me not pick my girl. <laughs> you are fixated on drawing her and her only. No one's going to get sorry. in your way. I was going to be nice and be like, you guys can pick who I draw. You're no. like, no one would draw I'm for you. Her. I'm drawing, I'm drawing for you. <laughs> I'm a little protective over her, but that's okay. She's mine. If she's yours, she's actually not. Just letting you know. So before I pick, here are all the villagers in my campsite. Here's my campsite. Here's me. I'm really iconic. If you want to follow either of our accounts in Kapaka Camp, here's our user ID. Mm -hmm. You can type in. We'll add you. We'll yes. all be friends. Anyways, Blue Moon, go ahead and pick. I'll hold this for you. Okay. You gotta close your eyes. I'm closing my eyes. <laughs> gonna be really extra. Okay. Who is this? Bob! Bob. Yeah! <laughs> Bob! Oh yeah! yeah. Loki! Ah! Oh, oh no! <laughs> Loki Bob is one of my favorites, so I'm happy I got him, and now I gotta figure out a design. Let's get started. Alright, this is my idea for Freya. I drew up a little bit of a sketch of what I want to do. So basically, I want to do three outfits, and one is going to be a bomber jacket, one is going to be a traditional Japanese dress, and one of them is going to be her classic sweater she wears. So let me take you to the reasons why I chose this outfit. So I looked up some information on the wiki of Animal Crossing because I'm that dedicated. Her character gotta be at least correct. correct. Yes, that's the word. So her name in Japanese is Sundora, which is Tundra basically in Japanese, which is where wolves live. And she likes rock music, so I'm giving her more of an edgy vibe. And she's also wearing that jacket in my own Animal Crossing game. She likes modern furniture, and she likes to collect musical instruments. There are this many types of Animal Crossing personalities in the game, and she is a snooty type. So I found it interesting on the wiki, it said she wanted to be a judge. And I'm like thinking it's because she's low-key a snake. She wants to tattletale basically, because she's snooty and she does gossip and she doesn't get along with lazy Animal Crossing villagers. I found out that she was the first female wolf in the game, so she has a tomboy vibe to her because she was surrounded by dudes. I wrote that she likes peeling apples because I thought it was really funny, <laughs> and her catchphrase is oofda, which means oh no, basically. <laughs> it's a different form of oof. <laughs> it's like oof. And I do not know if I'm going to do this outfit in blue or pink. In the game, it's blue, but like she is pink, so I don't know. Cause I was thinking about doing her skin tone pink, but I just might make her like skin tone peachy. I am not sure, but we'll see. Anyways, that was all about Freya, so time for Bob. So my sketches aren't as put together as Red Moon's are. I just kind of drew the basics of what I wanted to do or have in his outfit. So let's go over Bob's character first before I go over his outfit. He has the lazy personality trait, he plays video games and he reads comics, he's basically just a gamer boy icon. His catchphrase in older games was YOLO, which is kinda new at the time, um, this is kinda outdated phrase now, but his new phrase in Pocket Camp is, I'm a cat, chillin' is in my blood, man. <laughs> Here is some of the outfits I'm gonna do. I wanna point out, I wasn't gonna include this shirt in his outfit, but everyone seems to love it because I saw a lot of people say that I didn't know he was a guy or a girl when he came into their campsite, and a lot of people just say he's gender fluid or just kind of like a guy that likes dressing kinda girly. So it's iconic and I decided to include it because he doesn't really care what people think. He's lazy and unlike snooty Animal Crossing characters, you know, he doesn't really care. He's gonna have a flannel tied around his waist, which goes with his theme of all the furniture that he likes. He likes kitty furniture in game, so I decided to incorporate it in his flannel. And moving up, I don't know why, I really wanted to give him really light blue, like flared out jeans. And of course, since he's such an icon, he's gonna wear purple Crocs. I'm not done. He's also gonna have a puka shell necklace. <laughs> and he's gonna have kind of longish hair, so from certain angles, he may look like a girl. And um, I might make him have 
this pose to make it look like he has cat ears. And what's his name in um, Japanese? It's Nikoban. And I saw that his phrase in English is like, Pfft. I don't know, whatever that is. But in <laughs> Japanese, it's Neko, literally, which is cat. So um, that was Bob. Yes. This is Freya, and we're gonna bring you to our final sketches. <laughs> All right, here are the sketches. This is mine, and this is Blue Moon's. I'm gonna go over mine really quick, so get that out of the way. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna start off by saying I did three poses. The first one, like I said, was gonna be her bomber jacket. Here's her sweater, and then here's her amazing kimono. I love it. This actually turned out way better than I thought it's it would. Super cute. Thank you. I had to redraw her pose a bunch of times because it just looked really awkward. And oh my God, who is that? That's her, <laughs> and that's her too. Isn't that so crazy? And anyway, I added a speaker, a drum, and an apple. Remember, she liked peeling apples, and she likes musical instruments, along with cherry blossoms since it's like springtime right now and cherry blossoms are blooming thought it'd be really pretty let me explain the poses i decided to have her sassily chewing gum because she's a snooty villager since she's in my camp she likes me so like this is her like waving to me i'm like picturing this in my head if you were to walk up on her at animal crossing and she's minding her own business that's what she looks like she's wearing her classic average sweater and she's making an average face now on to reviewing blue moon <laughs> All right, here's that magnificent Bob, or Nikoban in Japanese. As you can see, I incorporated everything I was going to incorporate in his outfit. He has the flared jeans, the flannel tied around his waist, the tank top iconic shirt, and like a little capsule toy necklace because he likes like all the kitty toy objects. Like in my village, he has a purple star shirt. So I drew him in his purple star shirt in this sketch and in the original outfit, I drew it on his pants. His little description says he likes comics books and playing video games and eating. So I drew him eating noodles. I tried to keep in mind that a lot of People think he's a girl, so I kind of kept it a little bit androgynous looking. Oh, and who's that? That's actually Bye. him. Bye. Bye. That's him too. Here he is in all his glory. I love it. I love how it turned out. Here's our two pictures together. We're going to trace them and get back to you for coloring. Three, two, one. Bam. Bam. All right, here they are, beautifully traced. I think we did a pretty good job tracing them. Usually I mess up on one thing, but I mean, besides his hair right there, I think I'm good. But that's okay. We're going to start coloring, starting with my drawing. Let's go. Now it's my turn to color. Sorry if the lighting looks a little bit weird compared to Red Moon's lighting because it randomly started thunderstorming like five minutes ago. So we had to do this whole light setup. And if we didn't have these bright lights, it would look like this. So we're gonna keep the lights on and continue. So sorry if the lighting's weird. Let's begin.
we're done. Finally, this only took two days, surprisingly. I thought it was gonna take way longer. Like to you, it felt like only 10 minutes, but for yeah. us, it's been two days of me drawing this, so I'm kind of like done looking at it, yeah. but I'm, I'm proud of it, it nonetheless. Yes. I'm just gonna review mine real quick. I picked a lot of pink colors, and I think I might have picked too dark of a pink. I should have gone lighter, but like I can't do anything about it now. Right. It's not like I did it on the computer. I can just press back. So Freya is looking a little sunburnt. That's all I'm gonna say, but. <laughs> I think that's all I wanna say. Let us know what you guys think down in the comments. And yes. today's fun fact of the day is the Japanese word, gakko, which, which means, means school. Yes. <laughs> um, but we don't have that anymore. Surprise, surprise, we just found out today that we don't have school for the rest of the year and being seniors, um, that really sucks a lot. So I don't know when we're gonna graduate, if we're gonna have a graduation ceremony, we're yeah. gonna miss prom and a lot of other stuff, a lot like of spring break and, and senior skip day. and So we're kind of sad about it, but we'll be making more videos for you guys. So yeah. It's good for you. <laughs> we have a lot of free time now. So the, the word of the day is meaningless to me now. Yes. <laughs> Get that out of the way. <laughs> Ew, Ooh. school? We don't know oh, her. We still have school work, so we kind of have to still go, go to school. I we, we know her, but we're kind of like, like, like who? But that's besides yeah. the point. If you have any ideas for videos in the future, please suggest them down in the comments because like we said, we have a lot of free time and we really need stuff to do. <laughs> so if you have any good ideas about drawing or anything, just suggest it and we'll probably do it because we're bored. <laughs> and also make sure to follow us on Instagram because, you know, we have a lot more free time. We're going to be posting photos yes. and on TikTok, actually. <laughs> Long we story. Cracked, we cracked a while ago, got a TikTok. Didn't think any of you guys would find us on there, yeah. but you did. So we might as well just come out and be like, we Here's our one. TikTok, so I mean, if you want to add us on Animal Crossing on our phones, here's our user yep. IDs. Yep. Without further ado, random, random dance, dance party! party. Alright, bye. See you guys. And today we're going to be drawing our Animal Crossing village. I don't know why I keep saying characters. I'm sorry. <laughs> Oh my god, my first villager, Gracie! Oh! <laughs> my first villager is Gracie! <laughs> oh, hello! 